right now. Out of Snohomish, Bill Beavert, the 77, Randy Vaughn, and the 96, Dan Hunsinger. The first race of the evening is underway. Construction, BT Automotive, the Albert Brothers, and the Fent family. Two out of three for the 360 cars. Seven cars for eight laps. Willis and Barnes. Green flag. Yellow flag comes out. We will. Try it again. We've still field into three and off of four. That's better. Green flag. Again, the top five positions is what you're going for for an automatic berth in the feature race. As they open it up down the back stretch. Thank you. 
the veteran driver out of Everett, Washington. Checkered flag and the victory. Sebo, a good ride for second. Robbie Squillis third. Kurt McKinney and John Volbrack will come home in the number five position. Ports, is that the Jenkins or the Gambler, Leo? That's the 93 Gambler there, mid two car. James Grantham. The 98, Joe Hancock, 37, also involved in that wreck last week. Nice to see him back. Dennis Irby. And the 19 car of Kyle Secord. We've got trouble in two, and we've got a double flip. Tupper, the 48 car, and for the second week in a row, Dennis Army, after being involved in the incident with Leo here last week down the front straightaway. Green flag. Once again, As you can see, Kyle Secord valiantly trying to climb out of that 19 car. And all oh, the belts and the armor straights, he bails out of there in turn number three. The race is officially completed, folks. The winner of the 64 car, James Grantham. And uh, Leo Voigt, James Grantham, he's, uh, he's a guy that can make his uh, cars go fast here at the Speedway. He's actually a member of the 12-second club when he ran. The 9, LaConnor, Todd Von Stroberg, the 29, Oak Harbor, Don Norman, the 99, Bellingham, Bob Janicek, and the 28, your point leader, Rick Smith. Your leaders coming close together off of turn number four. Todd Von Strober, turn number nine. As we keep our eye on Rick Smith, the 28, the five-time main event winner here this year. Rick Smith going up top. Still Von Strobert leading Huggins. 
Norman Smith now in the third. Watch the 28 car. a battle for the lead here momentarily, folks. Von Stroberg with Rick Smith in his rear view mirror. 13 to the pit area. Looks like Huggins slowing down as well. And we go yellow, yellow flag. That will allow us to end in more trouble now. Man, oh man, the Gremlins are out tonight, aren't they? Single file restart with just three laps, three cars remaining and three laps to go. Green flag. Rick Smith to the inside, takes the lead. Transmission outlet, charge it, Chuck Decker. And car 71, the rookie, Charlie Severson. Green flag. of taking the lead from Rick Nelson only to have the yellow flag come out both times. Single file restart. Let's see if Chuck Decker can make it the third time lucky. Second of three heat races for the late models. Yep. 
himself the lead. He has himself the white flag. One lap to go after trying for two times. His brother Mel Decker track side watching as Charger Chuck Decker up of third for the checkered flag and the victory. Second place will go to Ultra over Nelson, Benson, and we'll see Jesse out of Bellingham. G Quans. It's not a trophy dash, it's a heat race. Four cars, green flag. Cars line up, please. Four ten sprint cars line up. Tom Bigelow sponsors the number 40 car, along with a whole host of others, for the leader, Mike Powers.
Lundy will get second, Ridge third, and Ellis fourth, but a gentle roll for John Vangenberg as the race leaders took the checkered flag. John Vangenberg just about the same spot Jeff Fletcher did it earlier tonight. Second heat race for the 410s. Where is the time going? Car number eight, Bowman, 22, George Graham, 20, Pat Q and 04, Butch Gilbert, 42, the star last weekend, fifth in the Dirt Cup, Alan Bond, and Chana Albanese, green flag. Tim Levine is in hot pursuit. Maybe he'll feel a little 
Surprise, surprise, Ron Eliasson driving the 06 car as we hear the oohs and ahs from you folks out there. Car number 8, Dale Knudsen, 99, Sandy Stribling. Oh my goodness, listen to that crew. Clayton Houston and Jason Thomas. We are underway. Let's see how Ron Eliasson does in his return to sprint car racing, the 06.
Eaton. The rookie driver, Jones, leading the way. Looks like some smoke coming from the seven car. We're only halfway there. Four down and four to go. Knudsen tries to go by up top. Can't do it. Here come the leaders off of the fourth turn. Again, Knudsen up into the marbles, as they call it. Now the backstretch. Jones again moves right up. It shuts the door. We've got a good race here, fans. They come off of the fourth turn. Looks like Knudsen might have them this time. Into the first turn, we've got a lap car there as well. Knudsen will, in fact, take the lead. Currently fourth in the standing. Dale Knudsen looks at the white flag. One lap to go. And looks like he will prevent Ron Jones from his first victory here at the Speedwell. But we are coming up on some slower cars again. Jones might have one more chance at it. White flag, it will be a drag race, it'll be Jones! Ron Jones takes advantage of the slower cars and goes up top for the victory for his first ever Skagit win as he is shaking his fist in jubilation over there. Out of Surrey, British Columbia, your winner, Ron Jones. Well, from Everett, Barry Tippy Martinez. Car number 64 from Everett, that's Sandy Bobber, the six car. Matt Burnett, Brian Loy, the 04. Matt Loving, and the 17, Travis Hawthorne.
Sudfeld and Seaball. First of four dashes. White flag, one lap to go for Jay Smith. Again, you can see Grantham going through the rough stuff in turn two. Checkered flag, victory, Jay Smith. Picks up the win. Bob Smith, you got those new dice with you? Dick Campbell, he's drilling oil well past Lou. Sponsored by Come on, Jay, that's no good. You're all can't wait for it. Come on, Jay. I'm going to get out. I'm going to get out. I'm going to
from Ryan Loy, looking to move up into the feature race. Off of turn four, your winner is Ryan Bubba Loy. Mike Dills will move up. And how about this? His first ever race at Skagit Speedway for the 49 car of Buddy Missick. He missed the heat races. He will move straight to the feature. Rod Perkins with 308 Green Flag. What's going through the driver's minds right now? And we got a lot of fast cars at the back. Beaver, Army, Fletcher, point leaders at the back. We'll watch the front. We'll watch them too. Green Flag!
up on the left guard. We'll see if it slows him down at all. Billy Beaver upstairs high at turn number one. With five laps to go. 15 down, five to go. Dennis Army on the inside of Tyson Haas. Goes into fourth place, so it's Smith, Zebo, Hunt, Army, and Haas. Swap a little paint again through 
one and two. Next time around, we'll be halfway. Ten down, ten to go. Powers again to the inside. Again, Quan sends a, a spin in four. Spin in four, yellow flag. Bring you the very best in dirt track racing, which again resumes.
second place. 17 Flubber, 7 B, 22 Graham. Still early.
the second place car up for all. Green flag, here we go. Bobby Burrow underneath the lap cars running second. Randy Red trying to hang on. Oh no, George Graham is smoking and dropping back. What a tough break this would be for the Victoria driver. He is off the pace. He'll try and make it the final two laps. It's Tim Levine, Bobby Burrow, Alan Bond now third. White flag, one to go. down the back straight away. Into three off of four. Make it two main event wins this year for Tim Levine. Bobby Burrow will run second. Alan Bunn third. Randy Ridge fourth. Looks like Gilbert for fifth. And George Graham sixth. Shana Albany's Jerry Bundy. Rick Faber and the rest of the field. There's your winner, Tim Levine, race fans. This is all North America. I would have to agree with that. Boy, we got a good field of cars here tonight. And as we said, these 18 cars were the stars last weekend down in Oregon. Here they are la last on the schedule tonight. Green flag. Trouble in turn one. Yellow flag.
Hobart race leader, Travis Hawthorne now on the inside. Still sideways in turn one. We will go yell to go. Trouble coming off of four. Your lead car is being and then the next moment getting towed back to the pit area on the tow truck. Eight cars remain. All nine hour, we try and wrap it up. Steve Kilcup, your leader. Here comes Logston. Wayne Logston on the inside takes the lead. Your new leader, another rookie, Wayne Logston. Down the back stretch. He leads Kilcup and Bobber. Here comes the white flag. main event victory at Skagit Speedway. The 65 car, cautiously, off of four, your winner, Wayne Logston. Steve Kilcup, second, Sandy Bobber with a great ride to come home third. The 49 car, his first night out, 